incredible wonder and immense challenges. And it is our collective hunger for innovation, our curiosity and our collaboration that grows our knowledge and allows us to thrive. This is the first autonomous commercial vessel in the world, and it's also the first commercial zero ballast vessel in the world. The idea was actually to transfer the goods from the road into a conventional container feeder. That was the start. And then we started to look into more environmental friendly ways of doing the shipping activities. Yeah, as a fertilizer company, not a shipbuilder. So to make uh, something like this a reality, we had to collaborate. For us, the natural and uh, very good partner was Kongsberg, who has the technology to pull something like this through. This project is the world's first fully electric, autonomous, ballast-free container feeder. And so it will be a game changer for the environment and for the shipping industry. The number of containers coming out of Porsgrunn have risen steadily and it's become more of a problem in the last, say, five years. So over time we have been more and more interested in solving it. This vessel will transport fertilizer from uh, Yara production plant to the two export container ports in Brevik and Larvik. We estimate uh, that uh, on behalf of Yara it will transport approximately 25,000 containers per year. They have a real need and they need to improve the local environment where they operate. So that's what's so exciting about this project. And I think what set this opportunity uh, aside from many others is that we could reduce emissions by moving truck transport to sea. The thing about the Yara is if you look at our mission is to feed the world and protect the planet. And very few opportunities arise that both enable us to save costs, to impact the environment in a good way, but also to really impact the wider business community positively.